Now watch, Rem said, indicating the native. Maka had been absent, exploring the countryside in the immediate vicinity of their landing place, and had not witnessed the capture of the native, or the tests his two companions made on it. Maka followed Rem's gaze to where the biped native sat hunched. The creature was bent into an ungainly position, its body crooked at incongruous angles, in such a way as to allow most of its weight to rest on a packing box at the base of a middle angle. Its stubby feet, on the ends of thin pipe-like legs, rested against the floor of the spaceship. Its body was covered, almost entirely, with an artificial skin material of various colours. Some of the colours hurt Macca's eyes. In the few places where the flesh showed through, the skin was an unhealthy, pallid white. Slowly, the creature's head...